What's one of the very best pieces of advice I have ever received? Now, before I answer that question, here's something I want to share with you, something personal. What many people don't know about me is that at one point in time, I wanted to become a professional musician. I auditioned for the conservatory on cornet, this very instrument, and I got in! Yay! But spending a whole life tied to one instrument seemed so limited, so I didn't follow through. I studied musicology instead, but I sucked at music theory, so I gave that up too. I love performing, though, until this day music is one of my biggest passions. I've been part of brass bands, marching bands, jazz bands, and various choirs. In fact, if you look carefully behind me, that's me in a student orchestra. There's nothing like the thrill of people making music together. When I was a student at university, I became a member of a choir dedicated to the preservation of plain chant, and that's the earliest form of Western music. This is us, looking very pious here. I'm somewhere over there. <laughs> we got to sing all over Europe in the most beautiful churches and even sang for the Pope at the Papal Academy of Music. Don't believe me? Well, here's the Pope himself, John Paul II, and that's me in the background. Hi, Pope. Hello, Paul. <laughs> Not bad for the son of a Protestant minister, huh? And by the way, I also love playing the organ. And this is me playing the church organ. Uh, it's a little bit reflective, but you get the picture, huh? That is me. You know, when I was still inexperienced, I tended to lean heavily on the people playing or singing next to me. So when they made a mistake, I made that mistake too. At one point, I remember the conductor stopping the rehearsal and he said to me, Paul... Don't lean on the person next to you. If you keep on doing that, you'll never find your own sound. And if they don't show up for rehearsal, I expect you to know your parts and take the lead. This simple piece of advice stayed with me throughout my life. It's a lot easier to lean on people and let them lead. Followers don't have to take responsibility. They aren't exposed and won't be criticized as much. But as a follower, you won't stand out either. You're kind of hiding behind someone's back. If you keep on standing in someone's shadow, you'll never shine or stand out. It's safe, very safe, and it will get you nowhere. If you want to become a successful freelancer, musician, photographer, text writer, or voiceover, you cannot be second fiddle. You need to become the soloist. Now, if you're an introvert... That's not an easy message. But guess what? Who told you it would be easy? If it would be easy, everybody would be doing it and making tons of money, right? 